Hi there, it's Jason Blackman here, and today I'm going to show you how to import figures from Zero directly into TaxFiler. So, at the moment we're on the tax return page, so all I'm going to do is click on Add a New Section, and we're going to click on Self Employment, and we've got a button up here that says Import Accounts. So if we click on that, now we can see we can import data from VT and from Zero. So if we click on Zero, now at this point you will need to connect your Zero data to TaxFiler. I've previously already done this. So I can open up the organization and select Demo Company for now. And I'm then going to click on Allow Access for 30 minutes. Will then be taken back to TaxFiler and it's pulled the information from Zero into TaxFiler. It's got our organization name, the zero period end, and the period to import start and end dates. So once we're happy they're correct, we can click on Review Balances. And at that point, TaxFiler will show you all the balances that are in zero for that particular year. Obviously, for demo purposes now, there's not a lot here, but we can see it's pulled sales through, and we can make sure that the tax return field is the same. If not, we do have the ability to change it. So we've got light power heating. That's at the moment under rent rates and power, which is correct. But again, we can change it. And we can also enter any amount disallowed if we want to. And at the bottom here, we've got the balance sheet codes, so we can make sure they're correct as well. Once we're happy, we can click on Save. And there we go. All the details from Zero has been pulled directly into TaxFiler. So we can then scroll down the page as normal, enter any capital allowances that we need to. But apart from that, our data has all been automatically entered.